Well, public meetings will be held tonight in Ashurst and Woodville for residents frustrated about the extended closure of the Manawatu Gorge. The road has been closed since a slip in April and the New Zealand Transport Agency pulled all staff out of the area 10 days ago, saying the sliding hillside made conditions too dangerous to work safely. Our reporter Jacob McSweeney is at the Valley View Centre in Ashurst. Hello, Jacob. Hello. How many people are there? Uh, hard to say right now, but it's definitely looking like it's well over 300 so far, and people are still coming in. I can see some people just coming in now. I'm at the door. The meeting's just kicked off. They had set out seats for what look like about 200 when I talked to the NZTA people, and oh, someone's just telling me now about 240. What are the issues? What, what are the people most concerned about? So it's really um, a tale of two towns. You've, you, like you said there, I'm in, I'm in Ashurst. So this, this is a small suburban town. Um, there aren't many shops at all. It's, it's largely houses. It's quite flat. There are kids that run along the sides of the street. And the issue here for, for people in Ashurst is big, big trucks just running through the town, which you know now they are basically the, the main road for people coming from Hawke's Bay to uh, the Manawatu. So th their issue is is that road is just not, they're just not used to having big trucks and, and stinky sort of cattle trucks coming through as well. And they want basically a safer uh, alternative there. And the other issue is the road itself. The saddle road is, is just pockmarked. There are temporary speed limits throughout it. It is very curvy. It doesn't handle well with bad weather. They largely want certainty and um, they're hoping to get that today from NZTA. Thanks, Jacob. That's our reporter, Jacob McSweeney, at the Valley View Centre in Ashurst.